Hi everybody, it's Boaz Fowler and I'm here with the Daily Astrology Forecast for April 18th, 2016. The moon is in Virgo today and it's conjunct Jupiter. It's a time that we could be more benevolent or more optimistic than usual. Since this is a moon in, in, uh, in Virgo, we could be overly critical with this conjunction to Jupiter. We have to be careful not to preach today. But this is a day that we can enjoy ourselves, we can expand our horizons, and we can feel the abundance of life uh, today. There is a square to Saturn, we can feel a little ill-supported by our surroundings today. And we need to carry our own responsibilities with dignity and not with a sucking face. And there's a trying to Pluto that helps us do exactly that, we can find our own power within us today. And there's a grand trine between the Moon and Jupiter, uh, Vesta and Mercury, and Pluto. That's around 1300 hours uh, Central European time, that's around 7 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. This is a time we are ev evolving in. We understand ourselves better, we, got, we are growing to really um, become more committed to our truth. So. Let's understand this sentence a minute. We are evolving Pluto. We are becoming, we are growing to understand Jupiter, ourselves, Moon, better and become more committed, Vesta, to our truth, Jupiter. So, the Moon becomes void, of course, from uh, 1430 Central European time, that's around 1030 Eastern Standard Time, but it's still Queen Conquest, Uranus, on Hegea and the North Node at around 1800 hours Central European time, that's 12 noon Eastern Standard Time. It's a time of drawing inside, there's a lot of intuition, there's some revelation for the rest of the way, from the, for the next patch of road we need to go through. And a uh, health subject could be on the table right now, because Hegea is on the North Node and the Moon is conjuncting it today, so definitely health subjects are something we are dealing with today. Venus is trining Saturn in the sky. It's a time that our relationships could stabilize, could mature, and in some ways are tested. There are things that are not uh, really realistic or are not really um, concrete. They would rise up so we could deal with them, so our relationships could evolve. Mars is already in its retro, and today the higher octave Pluto is joining it in a, in a retro motion as well. So Pluto in charge of our sexuality, of our psychology, of anything hidden from the eye, our subconscious and the whole regenerative process of building power and leaving power behind, building power and leaving power behind, uh, building and destruction within our own lives. All the cycles are acting in a different way too during the next period of time so we have to accept it and this adds to the spice of this of this, the heavens already with so much retrograde motion in the sky already so thank you for listening i hope you have a positive day and we'll see you all tomorrow take care bye bye